Hi Taurus, welcome back. This is your February 4 and 5 reading for Taurus. Let's see what the messages are for you, Taurus. We have the Ace of Cups flipping over, but I didn't shuffle yet, so this could be new love. Taurus, someone rising back in the north line for Taurus. What's the messages? For Taurus, someone rising Venus in the north node, February 4 and 5. What's coming in for Taurus, February 4 and 5? Okay, we have the two of pentacles. So a back and forth conversation with the professional. So you're having a professional conversation back and forth with someone. You have five of swords and the page of pentacles. Or you feel like somebody's being condescending or they're, they are passive aggressive. What's the two of pentacles and the queen of swords? Yeah, we have the devil card. Okay, what's the two of pentacles and the queen of swords? There's the Ace of Cups coming out again. And yeah, so somebody you were on and off with could possibly be an air sign. You're walking away from that towards new love or somebody that, or something like that. But you're going from the Eight of Cups to the Ace of Cups. So you're starting completely over here. Something, But I'm getting like something is on and off with someone. It could be an air sign, a Libra, but it could be any sign, okay? It could be, it's the energy that we carry. Yeah, the um, Six of Swords and the Eight of Cups. You're walking away or you're moving on or you're leaving something behind here. Okay, you're done. You, you you want something new. The letter M could be significant. Yeah, the nine of swords and the justice. So you could be uh, worried about this. Yeah, Libra could be significant. You're worried about this or this legal situation, whatever's going on in court or the judicial system or whatever this this court situation is. But I feel like you could be walking away or you're or or something. Yeah, we have the full card. If somebody's being released here. The three of wands. So I see you walking away. Yeah, the ace of cups. What's the eight of cups and the six of swords? Yeah, the seven of cups. What is the eight of cups, six of swords, and the ace of cups? So you're definitely turning your back on the situation. I'm getting you walking away. You, it, it's just, it's just too much. You have the seven of cups. You're walking away or you're going towards somebody, but you, you're confused. Maybe you're confused about how they feel about you, if they love you, if they will accept. Okay, let's see. Or if somebody's in a relationship or what. Yeah, we have the justice of coming out. Yeah, Libra energy and the full card. So maybe you're confused or you're wondering if somebody's in a relationship or if somebody um, is um, uh, free if or, or what. Yeah, what's the Nine of Swords wanting to come out so bad for? Okay, what's the Nine of Swords? So you're worried about somebody moving on or having new love or being free or a legal situation or being free from a legal situation or confusion. Yeah, I'm, I'm just getting your, your... What's that? Okay. Yeah, the Eight of Wands and the Hangman in the reverse. So that the Hangman of Right could be delays or waiting, a pause. But in, in the reverse, I feel like something, you're, you're confused as the Eight of Wands, as somebody's progression or, or how somebody's able to move forward or get justice. Yeah. So something that was very unstable, you're walking away from and you're going to something new. You're getting justice. You have the full card because you're taking this leap of faith. You're doing something completely new, full in the Ace of Cups, and you're getting justice with the Eight of Wands. It's like somebody's worried about that. They're confused. They don't understand how you did that or how you're growing or or something or how something isn't delayed or, or how something is moving for you. What what Seven of Cups and the Eight of Wands. Yeah, yeah, okay. The Empress and the Ten of Cups, the Seven of, what's the Eight of Cups? In, I mean, Eight of Wands, Seven of Cups. Yeah, the Sun card, Leo energy, how you're, how you're happy, how you're growing, um, Taurus, how you're doing this. Libra, Leo energy here, or Pisces, or an Aquarius, but it could be any sign. But you're getting justice with the justice here. Something is justice or something is deserved for you. That's why you're getting it or whatever the fuck. Somebody seems to be stressed out or worried about you moving forward to this new opportunity, walking away, or um, something is not on and off again. You have went cold or you set boundaries or you just don't give a fuck. Okay, you're moving on. You're not stuck or trapped or any of that shit. Yeah, the, the Knight of Cups. Now somebody wants to apologize. You have the Three of Wands. What's the Nine of Swords? I feel like somebody lost. What's the Nine of Swords? Somebody's worried about your progression or how are you doing this? How are you happy or how are you progressing or how are you something? 
Yeah, the Ace of Wands. Someone's worried about you also having sex with someone, meeting someone new, doing something new, or this new opportunity somebody is confused about. Yeah, the Page of Cups. Now they want to uh, make an offer. What's the Seven of Cups? What else is this person? Why is this person the Seven of Cups? So this looks, yeah, okay. Every time I ask what the Seven of Cups is, it's something like about an opportunity. So someone's confused or they, or, or they seem to be confused about this opportunity. How did you get this? Or um, how are you free? Or how are you unencumbered? Or how are you something? Someone's confused about how you got this money, this opportunity or something, how you're happy or this clean bill of health or something like that, Taurus. You're getting justice. You have the Seven of Wands, the Ten of Cups, and the Empress. Seven of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. Okay, now we have the Star and the Lovers. Okay, let's see. So yeah, you're getting you're getting something new. You're doing something new. You see, I I, I feel like somebody thought that you were gonna be like um, unhappy. Yeah, the Knight of Pentacles and the Page of Cups. Somebody took forever to apologize to you. I thought I guess they thought you were gonna go back and forth with them or chase after them or that you would give a fuck and you do not at all. Or somebody thought that you were gonna wait on them or that you were waiting on them. You are not. You are moving on. Somebody is confused or you don't give a fuck. I don't know why somebody thought you as tourist bitch would be waiting on them or you would care. No, bitch, I'm not. Or you thought this or whatever the fuck. It's a no. Will of Fortune and the Five of Cups, yeah. The tables have turned. Somebody has lost. I don't know what, or, or somebody thought something was a game. What's the Knight of Pentacles? It's absolutely not a motherfucking game. I feel like somebody was trying to delay or stop something. It's not. Yeah, the Seven of Wands. So I'm getting you're rejecting this person. Somebody did something or they took too long to apologize or something like that. Yeah, the King of Swords and the Three of Cups. What's the Seven of Wands? I'm getting your setting boundaries. You do not want this apology. You do not want none of that shit. It's over, it's dead, and it's done. Yeah, you're blocking somebody or you're putting barriers up or you don't care. Yeah, the Three of Swords in reverse. You're not heartbroken. You're not sad. You're not any of that. You don't care. Somebody thought that you were sad or crying. You're not at all with the Three of Swords in the reverse or that you were waiting or that you would care. You block their ass and you want to keep them that way and you're going to keep them that way. Yeah, the Empress. I'm getting you getting your nails or hair done or you're somewhere chilling, doing you. You're not worried about this person. You don't give a fuck. What's the Three of Swords in the reverse? I don't know why somebody thought you would be heartbroken or sad or that you would give that much of a fuck when you absolutely don't. Okay, you absolutely do not. Yes, over the death card. I feel like I feel like what's the death card? Yeah, the Knight of Cups. That I saw the Knight of Cups. Yeah, the Five of Swords. Yeah, somebody. It wanted to come out in the reverse. Somebody refuses. They have this death card. Yeah, somebody refuses to change, or somebody's upset, or they want to get get back. Yeah. So I feel like somebody just cannot let go. They have to get you back, or they have to do something here because you're over it. You're not heartbreaking. You're you're not heartbroken. You're moving forward. You don't care. The death card in in, in the reverse is like somebody who will not change. It could be a Scorpio. Somebody that refuses. They keep trying to. They, they just don't, they just cannot accept that it's a fucking rap, bitch. Go. What's the death card in the reverse five of swords? Somebody keeps trying to find, yeah, you already, you already have clarity about what somebody is doing. The ace of swords. I feel like somebody thought that you that that you were um, clingy or that you wouldn't care or that it, it, that that somebody tried to knock you off your pedestal. Yeah, the ace of swords, you already have clearly clarity of what someone is doing. Someone wants to knock you off your pedestal and make you not seem that attractive or to make you seem a certain way and you're not. You don't care. But somebody is really hoping and wishing that you would. What's the Empress? The Two of Cups. So there's somebody here. Yeah, the Two of Cups. So this is this could be your mother, but yeah, the Hierophant. Here you are, Taurus, in the Page of Wands. So the Empress and the Two of Cups. What is this? So you want to reconnect with this baby mother or or um this or, or this person or this is you. Somebody's in love with you, Taurus. They want to reconnect or say this. Somebody may be telling you they love you. What is the um Empress, Two of Cups, and the Ace of Swords? I'm getting like you want, yeah, the Will of Fortune. The tables have turned. Or you feel um I don't know. 
I do not know. Yeah, the magician. Aries energy here. Libra could be um, another Taurus like yourself, a Scorpio, Aquarius, Leo. Yeah, the Six of Wands and the Queen of Wands. So there is somebody here, the Three of Cups and the Ten of Cups that you want to be with. But I feel like somebody played games or they're nervous. Why? They're nervous about this apology or they're nervous about how they came at you or, or, or how they did you here. Or they're worried about something you know. Yeah, the High Priestess. What's the Nine of Swords? Somebody thought that they had you in a place where you were going to be, oh my gosh, yeah, the high priestess, Pisces energy. Somebody is worried about what you know. Yeah, the ten of swords and the, somebody knows you betrayed them or lied to them about being married or in a commitment. Somebody knows you're aware of that and they're worried about it. Yeah, the five of wands or, or that you tried to put them in a competitive position or have them competing with somebody. The empress don't compete with a fucking thing or nobody, bitch. It's not happening. What's the high priestess? Now somebody wants to watch and stalk you or whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, somebody tried to put you in a situation or have you as a mistress like you're a side peach bitch and you're not. Now somebody's obsessing over you or wanting to come towards you or wanting to whatever and it's over. It's a fuck no. Yeah, somebody thought it was funny to put you in a third party to hide you or have you as a mistress or somebody thought you didn't know this. I don't know how stupid somebody is, but you are... Or, or, yeah, the Ten of Swords is over. I'm getting, I'm getting it's not funny now. No more laughing because you moved on with a boss ass nigga. So now it's not funny. Yeah, the Ten of Swords, somebody betray you. They laughed. They thought it was funny to have you as a, to try to have you as a mistress or a side piece. Somebody thought you didn't know your worth or, they, or they're trying to make you feel like you're not worth anything other than being a side piece. That's over. Yeah, the world card is over. Two of Swords and the Nine of Wands. With the five of cups. Now somebody's annoyed and irritated and they regret lying, regret rejecting you, regret acting disinterested, regret trying to play you. They regret it. The nine of swords is there because you've moved on. You're free from the situation and you completely have turned your back. Now somebody's feeling out in the cold. Five of pentacles. Or somebody did something fucked up like went and married somebody to get back at another person who does not give a fuck. Three of swords in the reverse. They don't care. What's the sun card in the eight of wands with the ace of pentacles? Now somebody's mad or confused or the, the, how you get yeah, the star card. You're a star, Aquarius, you're a healer, or you shine very bright. Now somebody's confused as to how you're doing that, how you're getting that, how you, yeah, the eight of pentacles, you're very skilled at what you do. You know, somebody knows you have a very bright future. And somebody fucked up. I just feel like somebody likes to play the stupid games and it, it's just dumb. I'm getting you're not doing it. You don't care. It's a, it's a no fucking go for you. Just period. I'm going to end this reading. Okay. Yeah, because somebody's only apologizing five of swords in the page of cups because of your situation, because of what you have going on, or because they thought that they could beat you down or make you feel insecure or play you or try to do whatever this is, and that didn't work. So now they want to apologize and come correct with the higher font. Now they have respect for you, or now they want to respect you or hold you on this pedestal, or now they want to come at you in a different way. Yeah, they want to work it out. Because their taxes and bullshit, mind games and lies it didn't work on you. You already know what the high priestess and somebody knows you know. Now they're out in the cold. Their marriage is over or it's ending. Or somebody's going through a divorce. Or somebody's moving on. They want to come towards you. Or somebody ended something that they were on and off with for a long time. With somebody is over. They don't want it to be over though with the death card and the person. But it's over for you with the world card and the upright. It's complete. Now all of a sudden somebody has a, 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 a respect for you or somebody's amazed at how you grow, how you're able to grow something, how you're able to do something, how you're able to whatever this fucking is. Somebody thought you were a joke or something to be played with, you, with and you're not. Not at all. Now somebody's in the nine of swords. Yeah, and, and they want to work with you or they want to work it out. Somebody's watching you and, and, and nervous. What's the nine of swords? Somebody thought you were high, but yeah, the knight of wands because they try to play you or they try to come at you sexual or somebody regrets it or they try to do something here. I feel like somebody regrets coming at you sexual. They want to apologize for that. They want to respect you with the higher fine. Or they want to hold you on a pedestal. But this is after they try to beat you down or do whatever the fuck this is or make you feel low or whatever this is. 
So that's kind of what I'm getting here. Now somebody wants to come. To, correct. What's the Knight of Wands? One more. Yeah, the tower. It blew up in their face. Scorpio energy. Something blew up in somebody's face. Yeah, the lovers or somebody thought that they were going to get sex or something like that. And it didn't happen. It's not going to happen or, or whatever. Yeah, the tower, the nine of wands, five of cups, and the seven of swords. Something blew up in somebody's face or something just did not work out. Somebody was really, really, really hoping. Yeah, the four of wands in reverse. Wow. So this could be a situation of somebody burning, a home burning down possibly, or, the, or a breakdown in a relationship. Now something is not, yeah, because I feel like somebody is, somebody thought that they were going to come in and have sex with you and go back to whatever this is. Now that's blowing up, that's falling apart, or somebody's getting a divorce or it's over. Yeah, the Knight of Wands, now the King of Wands, and the Three of Pentacles. Now somebody, somebody wants to grow up. What's the Tower card? And the Four of Wands reverse. Tower card and the four of wands reverse. So something is over. Yeah, the page of wands and, and uh, the three of wands. Yeah. Page of wands, three of wands. Yeah, the moon card in the reverse. So secrets are coming out. The Eight of Swords, yeah, somebody kept in the, in the King of Cups, Queen of Cups, and the Lovers. Yeah, somebody has a relationship, their marriage, they, they married. The Moon card in the reverse. You know about it. The Page of Wands, you're in, you even got confirmation of it. You're done. It's over for you. Yeah, the Page of Swords. There's going to be, or somebody got some bad news here. Yeah, the Page of Wands and the Three of Wands. Somebody knows. Yeah. Somebody regrets doing something here. They're annoyed. They're agitated. They got this bad news or, or something like that. And you seem to be doing well. So someone's going to try to reach out or flirt with you possibly in the future here, but it's not going to happen or something. Somebody thought something was going to fall apart for you. It didn't. Someone's unhappy in their marriage or they're leaving it and they want to come to the fourth court cups as soon as I said that. Somebody's unhappy in their marriage and they're planning to come towards you. They want to date you or they're trying to figure out a sneaky way to do this or to hold on to you or something. Yeah, the strength, the devil, the six of pentacles, four of pentacles. Somebody could be trying to hold on to your money or do something with your money. It's not happening yet or bind you or something. It's not going to happen or hide you. It's a no. I'm about to end this reading. I'm tired of reading on y'all weird bitches. All right, this reading is over. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, and follow.